All right. Can you hear me? This this stream is going to be a big test. It's just a giant I'm not playing Power Wash Simulator. Twitch refuses to update the game that I'm playing until after I've started the stream. We're not power washing today. Uh, let's see here. Hello. Hey. Um... Oh, I didn't realize you. I'm going to be looking at you uh, over there. Uh, hey, everybody. I'm at Second Desk. Uh, this is Retro Desk over here. I just set it up yesterday. Different microphone, different everything. So um, please don't be shy. If there's a problem, let me know because I would like to know. Okay, that looks pretty good. Blurry Ian is back. He needs some lighting, I think. Good morning. How's it going? Uh, Amex Wolf, thank you for the $10. What up, Moose? My devices keep failing me and letting me know when you stream. I'm hoping to catch your next one and able to donate more, but just in case I miss another one, have some serious coinage. P.S. Please tell MJ Meow for me. She'll know what it means. Thank you so much, Amex. No audio delay. Everything's oh, looking good. Wow. Slight video delay. There should not. I mean, I think it's probably fine. I'm just going to choose. Yeah, I know I just said, let me know if anything's wrong, but I'm choosing to ignore the people that are saying something's wrong. Uh, slightly off by a sec. Try refreshing. Uh, I do have to do a delay. No delay on my end. Uh, I'm just going to leave it. I'm just going to leave it. I, I will leave because the delay, the delay is hard to, to uh, account for live. So I'll look at it later. I should be more blurry. I think I can do that. Uh, how aren't there effects? Input effects. I can be, is this blurry? Did that do anything? I probably shouldn't be messing with stuff. No, that didn't do anything. I should not be messing with stuff because I'm going to break something trying to make myself <laughs> mosaic. Okay. So I have set up for the day. Obviously, we're back on the... Uh, Windows 98. I really need a preview monitor. My only preview monitor is behind me, so I keep I keep turning around to look. Um. Right? Right? Yep. Still working? Nefco, thank you for the six months. Monochrome Bats, thank you for the six months. Sort of Vintage, thank you for the 22 months. Mm -hmm. Alice D'Angelo, thank you for the two months. Hi, Moose. Hope you have a great stream today. I can't stay to watch, unfortunately, but I'll catch you in the VOD. Shaving mirror to see the preview mirror. No, I think I just need a second monitor over here. I just need, you know, I need a, a little more setup. Friendly Mushroom, thank you for the prime sub. Uh, Pavi55, thank you for the 18 months, one and a half years, woo, hope you're doing well, Ian, brutal yes, I'm doing all right. Uh, I'm just using the 2035 currently, I think I might actually swap it, because I want, I don't want to move a microphone back and forth between desks, but I think I'll be over here more, so I think I should put the Shure, the 7MB over here. And then the uh, Audio Technica over there, because I'll use it less often. Does it sound okay, though? I haven't used this microphone in forever. Opossum Plays, thank you for gifting those subs. Hatless Daffodil, thank you for the 29 months. Sounds Christ. <laughs> thank you. The highs are a bit more present. 
I, well, I also found out, I also recently just found out that this fancy mixer that I use, you can set the type of microphone that you plug into it. So it's, it's very possible that I didn't have the Shure uh, mm-hmm. set up right until today. Writing Squiggle, thank you for the 28 months. Wood Panel, thank you for the seven months. Hello, hi. Fuggle Pug, thank you for the prime sub. The Donation Gnome, thank you for the $10. Funnily enough, I just finished watching the VOD of your last Power Wash stream. I'm looking forward to having the smooth, jazzy BGM drowned out by the sound of powerful, funneled water. I hate to disappoint, but uh, we are not we are not to power wa- power washing today. I have my um my death note mug. I hope everyone's drinking a nice uh, cup of uh, potato chip. Oh, Waffles wow. is a bunny. Thank you for the seventy months. Howdy, Moose. My iPad refused to send me the resub notification, so hopefully it goes through this time. How's the unpacking going? It's okay. As you can see, <laughs> like the most most of the house, if you look over here, well, it looks pretty good, right? Well, if you look over here, there's there's nothing over here. So it's kind of that's kind of how what I got going on right now. A bunch of stuff is set up, but I have not really. I still don't know what I'm doing here just yet, but it's going. Sterolar, thank you for the four months. Woohoo, I'm able to catch a stream. Thank you for always making fun videos. I miss that brutal cooking. My boyfriend started watching you after I had the fried chicken video on. I'm ready for more cooking and more Nance. Both are on the way. Yes, better lighting. Better lighting is, I, I just don't know... Because I'm not going to have my media shelves. You know, my media shelves with all the DVDs and VHS that was my background for forever. They're not going to be in here. So I'm like, well, I don't what uh, what the fuck am I going to do? <laughs> I just haven't figured it out yet. The chicken man cometh. Thank you for the two months. Hi, Moose. Happy two month moose anniversary. Hope you're settling into your new rat kingdom free home. Take it easy and enjoy a blue cotton candy chip ball thingy for me. The media shelves are just outside. So just outside of this room is uh, like it's a... It's like a gamer movie kind of den. That's where I got my big TV and my couch. And then I put all my... Because I was never using my shelves. I was never using my shelves. They were background decoration. And now I actually want to have them somewhere where I can go, Hmm, what do I want to play? I'll play this. So they're kind of by the... TV. Toothless Dubs, thank you for the prime sub. Grumpy Nebulous, thank you for the prime sub. Brumble Duck, thank you for the 17 months. Uh, Roy Scat, thank you for subscribing. Yeehaw Jew, thank you for the six months. Moose, what a good six months of giving you my money. I'm suffering major work burnout as well as chronic health issue flare, so I couldn't be more ready for a stream. Hope the move wasn't too bad. Congrats on being a homeowner. Thank you very much. Hope you uh, feel a bit better soon. The Moonsmith, thank you for the prime sub. Okay, so we're doing something like real basic today. I don't expect this to be a super long stream. Um, this is mostly a, te- a test, um, but I honestly, I already, it's already kind of fun being back over here. I like, I like being at my old computer. Um, thank you. Yes, I did buy Twitter. I'm going to rehaul it. I'm just going to, bur- just going to ban everybody. I'm just going to ban everybody off Twitter except for me. That's my, uh, that's my plan. Game Nomad Messy, thank you for the prime sub. Uh, how do we feel about uh, playing a game for ages three to six? Do you guys feel smart? You always want to do some reader rabbit? Because that's, uh, that's what I got here. And I, you know, that's what we're going to do. <laughs> okay, okay. So, wait, before I, before I have to say something. Hold on. Where'd it go? So, 
I got this, right? I got the Sims complete collection. I wanted all, you know, I wanted all the expansion packs. They gave me three discs of the complete collection and then one disc of the Sims Unleashed. So I don't have it. I can't use this. So I'm going to have to buy a whole nother set. Ridiculous. That's what we were going to do today. I was setting that up yesterday. I was like, oh, so excited to install it. It took me a while to realize what, why it wasn't working. Scammed. Okay, this should work though. This, this game should work. It was on eBay. I, I, I could get a refund, but honestly, I, I, I think it was probably a genuine mistake. Because the listing, I went back and looked at the pictures, and the, they did show this disc in the picture, and it does say disc one on it. Uh, I have a feeling that they just uh, made a little oopsie. Alert echo. How bad is the alert echo? Can you just hear it from my mic? Okay, yeah. The, the alerts are coming out of my PC speaker so I can hear them. Okay. Is it going to work or... Prison Shank, thank you for the bits. I blame you for fill the fridge. I'll have to relay that to my sister because I blame her for fill the fridge. Uh, set up, here we go. Welcome to Reader Rabbit 1 CD Setup Program. This setup will analyze your current system and check it for compatibility and possible problems. It will install all the files necessary to run Reader Rabbit 1. Setup has detected possible compatibility problems with your current system settings. I'm just going to continue it. Did that did it work? Installation is complete. Click <laughs> click to go on. Major Tom Servo, thank you for the 5 months. My fiance is sick today. Can you tell Finn to feel better? Feel better, Finn. Or else, that is a threat. And test donation, thank you for the $2. Click to go on. Okay. Are right, you guys ready to learn? Show of hands, who here already knows how to read? Or are we, uh, is this going to be a new skill? For some of us out there. Not, <laughs> not me. Juju Hermit, thank you for the two months. Ian, I've been a big fan of your work since Sociolatron times. Oh, those were the days. I got a dream job a couple of months ago and can finally give you some money to thank you for all the times you've soothed my brain. I did sh stop sharing the Sociolatron video with everyone after someone mistook it for me trying to seduce them, but I think that says more about that person than it does about me or your artistry. Love, ooh. Thank you very much, Juju Hermit. And NVTF, thank you for subscribing. Let's get smart. Reader Rabbit 1 will not run on a... Vi uh, 640, 480, 256. Uh, do I really have to restart? Let's just restart. Sure. Why not? It suggests I restart. I'll just restart. Domo Toast. Thank you for the two months. Well, how are you guys doing? I gotta wait now. This computer is a gateway. That was actually real quick. 
And this is real hardware. I'm so I'm so happy to be back. I want to work on my uh, my stream startup stuff because I don't I don't feel like I've topped the drive-in theme just yet, but I have a bunch of ideas. I really want to work on it. Um, but I'm really happy being back in standard def. Oh, please install a 64480. Please, though? Oh, wow. We might have to play something newer then. Oh, wait, no, it didn't change the colors. I'm not restarting. Apply color scheme without restarting. Our tempting tasty there we go. There we go. go with everything. Here comes Reader Rabbit. All right, Reader Rabbit. Bringing us some fun adventures. Reading words and choosing letters. Reader and his friends will help us learn together. Off to word bill. Soon we will be reading better. Yeah! Let's go! Hi, my name's Reader no, Rabbit. No, it's not. And this is my fabulous word factory. Don't like it. In here, we make words that name all sorts of things. While you are playing, if you ever need a hint, just choose me, and I'll be happy to help. Choose hey, me. Hey, come on down. Introduce yourself. Whee! <laughs> Hi, my name is Matt. That's short for Matilda. In my pocket is my friend Pop. We're the team that can get you around this place. When we get inside the factory, choose me to see. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. I'll show you how to get in. <laughs> I don't want to learn to read to anymore. Get into the factory, just spell your name, then click on play to start. Okay, sorry for the echo. Sorry for the echo. It's that's the I think that's part of the reason why I need to switch microphones. I think this microphone picks up more audio around here and I want to be able to I want to be able to hear it. Chelsea the sensible, thank you for the 11 months. Um Okay, well, we're just going to live with a little bit of echo. I'll, I'll turn it down. I. A. N. Is there, a, is there an echo now, or is that good? Boxy Foxes, thank you for the $4 and change. Hey, Moose, thank you so much for introducing me to Severance in one of your streams. You're welcome. Uh, it's overtaken my life, and I'm on my second watch through. I'm on my third, possibly fourth. I, don't, I think it's third. Currently forcing everyone I know to watch it. Who is your favorite character? Ooh, I like, um, oh, I'm not going to be able to remember anyone's name now that I'm on the spot. I like, uh, I like Milchick a lot. And, um, I also like the, the boss lady with the gray hair. But, uh, great, great show. Now you're inside the factory. To play, choose an activity. Welcome to the factory. Here, I'm going to shrink down a little bit. I'm so glad people are checking out Severance. Please watch Severance. It needs more seasons. I mean, it's getting another season, but it needs as many seasons <laughs> as it can get because I want it. And letter sounds. I like matching things. Let's match pictures to pictures. Pot. Pot. Who doesn't love a good pot? Can. Bag. Can. Is this helping anybody read? Can. Now you can read the word can. Pot. Net. Box. Net. Net. I really do Net. not like the characters. Uh, I don't like that something in the pocket is looking at me right here. You found Pop. Click on its buttons or click on its eyes to return to your activity. Uh. Bag. Box, bag, bag, pot, pot, box, box. Fuck yes. 
You did it. You did it. <laughs> Don't like it. Don't like that. Damn. Damn. Finn. Oh. <laughs> Creepy son. Log. Fin. Fin. Damn. 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 Sun. Sun. Log. Log. Hut. Hut. Ta-da! You did I can read now. Does it just keep going forever? Do I ever fan bed pen rug pen pin fan rug rug What have you been missing? You just tub. this. <laughs> just this. Bed. You've missed this. Tub tub bed bed bed, bed. pen pen Hooray! Okay. Um. Educational benefits. Reader Wet Rabbit One introduces early phonics concepts for developing readers. Mm -hmm. Phonics teaches. The, is, am I supposed to read this as a child? Phonics teaches the association of letters or groups of letters with their sounds. Did you know? Some children learn more effectively with the help of visual cues, while others benefit from auditory clues. Okay, this is not helpful for me as a child. Choose a challenge level. Challenge level? Match pictures to words. Oh. Match pictures to middle letters. Here we go. That's something. Wow, this is level six. Ah, peg. Mmm. Ah. Top. Yep. Cap. Ah. Oh, that was a hat. I can I can't really hear him. Ah. Oh. Oh. Hop. Peg. Hat. Ah. Hat. Do you guys have to do like phonics flashcards? Remember doing phonics flashcards? Anyone do hooked on phonics? I saw the commercials, but I didn't actually ever know what if it was what it was. Peg. You did. It. Yeah, I did. Hooked on meth. NR7, thank you for the 60 months. Hello, how's the new place? The new place is great. Still being set up, but uh, much better than the last. Cinephile Rail Railroad 93. Oh my God. Thank you for the bits. We uh, man, where's LeVar Burton from Reading Rainbow when he is truly needed? He's nowhere. He's not here. He's nowhere to be, Let's go. <laughs> nowhere to be found here. Called Jolly Phonics? I think we just did. I think we just got uh, cards from school. How's that? I feel like I should have more. Yeah. Okay. Now it's time for the sorter. Yeah. Let's find words with special letter sounds. Hi. Welcome to the sorter room. We'll show you how to play. As a word pops out of the machine, I look at its first letter itself. It's the same letter as in the white box. So let's put the word on the shelf. But if the letter is not the same, do you have a different plan? 
I take the word from the machine. I have a, I just got a thought. Hold on. Key. I just got a thought. Click on a shelf if the first letters match. Oh my goodness, hold on. Press the green button to start. I want to be able to hear. I think I can put headphones in this thing. Uh... Okay. I missed the instructions, but... Go? The beginning sound is... G. No, that did not work. Lob. No, that didn't work at all. <laughs> How old is everyone who actually played this game? I'm 30. I do remember playing this game. I honestly think I played the older version of this game. I don't think I, because this is an updated Reader Rabbit. I want to say that I played an older version. Or maybe it was a newer version? I don't think I played this one. I have no idea what I'm doing. Sag. Gum. Okay, okay. Gag. I gotcha. If I played the point and click reader rabbit Gag. game, I don't think so. Because I definitely played these mini games. I just don't think they looked as good. I don't remember uh, this one up here at all. And I also don't remember him looking so quite so freaky. Hug. Gob. Good. You found some of the words that begin with G. Okay, give me the Choose a challenge level. Sort by any letter. Sort by any letter. I pick. I pick. Slow. Medium. Fast. Oh shit. Sound is off. Sound is on. Okay. This is level four. Find the words that have a letter with the same sound and place as the letter in the white box. Put these words on the shelf. Put the other words in the trash can. Got it. The beginning sound is... Mmm. Mm. Wax. No. Not. Yeah. Nib. Yeah. Ned. This may be just a little too basic. We may have to we may have to change, change games here pretty quick. Gap. Knit. Wordacious. Wordacious. Oh well, look there they go. That's not terrifying. Cinephile Railroad, thank you for the bits. Uh, I was into Jumpstart, Sesame Street, and Locomotion. I didn't play any... I think I played some Jumpstart. Um, but not a ton. And thanks for the bits, Sushi Roll. Let's, let's change it up. This is... Uh, I'm not captivated yeah, quite yet. But maybe with okay. the labeler. Let's spell words to label crates. Welcome to the labeler room. We'll show you how to play. The first oh my God. of these words are missing. We need to fill them in. I know that the beginning sound of bug is b, so that's where I'll begin. B makes the b sound. Okay, let's choose the letter B. Hey, I spelled <laughs> the word bug. Hooray! 
Yay! Good for me. You can spell too. Just choose the empty space under the word you want to spell. Uh -huh. Then pick the letter that goes in that place. Mm -hmm. Take your time. Hey, Take your time. Ears. Red. Rrr. Rrr. Yeah, how do you how do you guys feel about the challenge here? Do you think that you would have been able to do uh red to do this as well as I've been doing or do you red. think it it looks a little more challenging? Pin Too challenging. Pop. I may have played the DOS go. version. It had better music. Also, the train level always stumped me. Thank you, the honey, for the bits. Did I play gizmos and gadgets? Hey, yeah, I actually think I have. Rib. Lip. Men. I thought I had that game. I thought I had it, but I don't see it. Okay, get me, get me out of here. We're going to the last game. We're going to the last game, and then we're bailing to something else. Let's go. <laughs> Reader Rabbit one, maybe okay, just a little great, great. Uh, here is where we load the oh words my God. From the factory onto the train headed for Wordville. And this, this is my friend Ernest. I do not like the train. Hi. <laughs> I'm Ernest, the big steamer engine. When you load me up, I'll take all your words to Wordville. Hey, you two, could you show them how to load my train? <laughs> I look at the word do in not the load him up. car. It has three letters. T. O P. Now, which word on the loading dock has two of the same letters? Hmm, let's see. Hey, I see T in the word tug. Uh oh, only the T is the same. And we still need a word that has two of the same letters. And tug doesn't. What a shame. Don't give up. Okay. <laughs> let's okay. Look at the map. Give up. Its letters are M. O Give up. P. Wow. Top and Mop have two of the same letters. They both have O and P. So I'll choose Mop and put it on the train. Now Mop is in the red framed car. Now, let's look for a word. That yeah, I got, it, I, got it, I got it. 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 Rub. Tub rub. Thank you very much. Everyone loves a good tub rub, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Hub. <laughs> Do not rub. <laughs> Plessin, thank you for the 12 months. TBH, that train doesn't give me top vibes. It gives me terrifying vibes. I don't like how he looks at me. Cub. All aboard! It's the Tub Rub Hub Club. All aboard. Jet. Set. Hey, that's it. Pet. Mm hmm. You got it. Wet. Jet set. All pet aboard. wet. There he goes. Hey, Ernest. Is it time to load you up? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 2 H fan club, thank you for the five dollars and change. Best or worst sound alert for this train? I think pretty, uh, pretty great. That was that was pretty great timing. Honestly. Not. Great. 
That word had two letters that are the same. Yeah, that's the whole point of the game, dude. Right. There's another one. Got. Okay, I have to I have to Hooray! change games. Wordville, here I come. I have to change games. It's okay. I got a backup with something that's actually. Hey, Ernest, is it time to load you up? Mm-hmm. Bet. Is it time to load you up? How to get out of here? Let me out. Let me out. Do you want to leave Rita Rabbit one? Yeah, forever, Bye -bye. please. <laughs> don't, don't ever let me go back here. Someday down the line, I'm gonna say, let's play some Rita Rabbit one, and you guys have to say no. Remember Ernest? Okay, how about um, this one's this one's uh, same company. A bit more challenging. Anybody remember? I think I did a video on this forever ago. Anybody play Mission Think? This was one of my favorites back then. I kind of remember it. I Shut remember. Up, bro, bust your face. Okay. Uh, how long did I play it for? I played. I played Reader Rabbit for maybe 20 minutes, it looks like. We've been going for 40. Five of that was the startup and then uh, the start of the stream. Thank you, Pepperoni Pizza Men, for the $6 and change. All right, let's play some Mission Think. I'm going to run out of hard drive space at some point. You hate the game design already. Come on. Come on. It's just a happy building. What's wrong with a, a happy, joyful building? I didn't give up on the creepy rabbit. I beat all the games. I think. Listen up, my metal minions. The people of Shady Glen will be sorry they ever messed with Morty Maxwell. I am now about to take over the Shady Glen Game Factory. From now on, the factory will make only the games and toys I design. I will be famous. My face will appear on every child's games and toys. The children will adore me. <laughs> they will want to be like me and even wear the same shoes that I wear. <laughs> As for you, my chrome domes, don't forget, I was the one who rescued your broken part from the recycling center and put you back together. Now I need you to help me. Even do-gooders like you, Rusty. Attention, everyone! I am changing the name of the Shady Glen Game Factory to the Marty Maxwell Game Factory. Needless to say, this is now my factory. However, to make things a bit more is that how that works? I challenge you to play my new strategy game. If you can beat me at all five levels, which would be quite a feat, I'll give you back the factory and leave a Shady Glen. Before you can play my game, you have to find the game pieces I have hidden in the warehouse. Some of the pieces are behind puzzle doors, so you'll have to solve the puzzles to get to those pieces. Good luck solving the puzzles. <laughs> it's really nice of him to be like, hey, this is my evil takeover, Design. but... Type your name. If you want to get rid of me, well, here's how you do it.
Draxy, thank you for the 73 months. Hi, Moosey, still enjoying the blue balls? Can't say that I am, though I am still eating the Utz cheese balls. I've only, I'm almost made my way through that entire tub. Uh, it's only a matter of time. Odin's Abode, thank you for the 22 months. Hey, Ian, I was just wondering if you like spicy food or not. My friends and I are doing the Hot Ones hot sauce tasting tomorrow, so I was just curious if you like spicy stuff or not. A little bit. A little bit. I'm pretty, I'm pretty, uh, I'm a weenie. I like a little bit of spice, but I don't think I could do a spice challenge, honestly. You can play the game with Morty's Metal Minions or without them. When the Metal Minions are in the warehouse with you, they will try to take your game pieces. Do you want to play with the Metal Minions? Yeah. You... Hi there. I'm Rusty. I'm glad you're here. I don't like the way Morty took over this factory, so I'd rather help you whenever I can. You can count on me. See you around. <laughs> I want to help you out. Bye. Uh, okay. So if I remember correctly, we just go in the, yeah. So, you're ready to challenge me at my strategy game? All you need now are some game pieces and, of course, a good strategy. Click on the strategy game book to learn more about the strategy. Oh, man. Click on the tube to go to the warehouse and look for game pieces. When you have the pieces you want, return here to challenge Morty at the strategy game. Okay, I think, if I remember correctly, the whole point of this game is you're just trying to get a piece from here, from like your starting zone to the finish zone. Do we need special pieces? Okay, well, a strategy game book doesn't work. Um, I guess I'm going to go this way then. Oh, there it is. Use the left arrow key or the right arrow key to move around the warehouse. Use the right and up arrow keys together to jump to the right. Use the left and up arrow keys together to jump to the left. Press the space bar to throw a magnet to a metal minion. Oops, a metal minion ran into you. The metal minions take one of your pieces when they run into you. Press the space bar to throw magnets That's bullshit. To them, and they will leave you alone for a while. They spawned one right next to me. Okay. Oh, that's not what I meant to do at all. Click on the no. tube to go to the warehouse. No face cam? Can you not see me? Sorry about that. Oh, fuck. You gotta play with the... How do you play without the metal minions? Oh my god, the jumping mechanics. Use the mouse to work on the puzzle. Click on the hint button to find out more about the puzzle. Use the puck to knock the ball into the hole. To move the puck, click... Okay. Press the down arrow key to pick up a box and get a piece. You have collected a game. Oh, okay. Okay, so you buy movement pieces. Well, this is starting to make more sense. I can't jump up. I can only jump across. I got to use the trampolines and the fountains and stuff to jump use up. Use the white pieces to build and line oh, up. Oh, I always love this. Front and side views of the 3D object. Click on a camera to see a view. Use the white pieces to build and line up the top. Do I do? A little confused. Um. Oh, oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. So who who has memories of this? I saw a couple people. This was seriously one of my favorites. I loved this game a lot. 
vague memories. Okay. Only from my video. When did that video even come out? It follows the rule on the elevator to reach the checkered flags. Click on the car to make it start. Uh, Treasure Mountain? I think I have Treasure Mountain, actually. You got frustrated with a strategy game. I definitely feel like I beat it, but... I could have just had a lot of patience. How do I get downstairs from here? I gotta go up to go down? Figure out the pattern of the objects on the conveyor belt. Then, fill in the empty spots. I gotta start working on a new video today. What should I, what should I make? It's gotta be something I can put together kinda quick. Food history, history kitchen, mystery tapes, escape challenge, more VHS. It has been a little while since I've done a VHS. I'm torn between doing another food thing. I've done, I think I did two, two food videos in a row, so I feel like I should do something else. Movie review. Use the white pieces to build and line up the top, front, and side views of the 3D object. Click on a camera to see a view. Yeah, mystery tapes can be can be time consuming, but honestly, I should. I think next time I do a mystery tapes, I'm gonna change up my process to try and you know smarter, not harder. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Harold gets it. Review my life thus far. I could just do a draw my life. Are people still doing draw my lives? Sam Jam Slam Ham, thank you for the 15 months. The only edutainment game that deserves to be remembered is Granny's Garden. Granny's Garden was the hottest shit back in 2003. Don't even talk to me unless you beat Granny's Garden. Can't say that I remember that one. Yeah, I definitely want to open... Oh, shit, I should have jumped. Oh. Dummy. Use the white pieces to build and line up the top. I definitely want to open my P.O. box soon. It's on. I'm glad. Thank you for the constant reminders because I need the encouragement. But I would love to do some like fan mail streams or something. I would be out of cycle to do that. A lot of people drew their lives. There were a lot of there's a lot of life drawing going on at the time. Yu-Gi-Oh! video. See, I don't... Well... I think it'd be fun to... Um, talk about... Season 1 Yu-Gi-Oh! Duelist Kingdom Yu-Gi-Oh! is... ripe for review. The strategy game is to move your marker to more I did end up playing Tower Unite Four Arcade. Moves his marker to your side. To start your turn, click on the Super Solver marker... I don't think I'm going to be able to get there. Uh, does this let me... What is the... Compass moves your marker across any forest. Okay. So I need to do... One, two, one, two, three. Yeah. This...
thrift store shop. Click on one of See, thrift pieces. store shop is probably a longer then, video because when I do that, I, I want to talk more up. about the stuff I get. If no square lights up, choose a different piece. But I have not been thrifting in quite some time. You. I need I need more pieces now. I can't uh I can't do what I wanted to do. Does Washington or Texas have better thrift finds? I, it just really depends. It's really store to store. What? That was bullshit. Put each object into the correct circle. Things with green. That was tough. Best thrift finds are always in suburbs surrounding cities. I feel like, yeah, I think smaller area is more consistent because you don't have as many people picking through it, but also it's just timing. Like one of my best my best thrift day was when I found all those big box humongous entertainment games at a Goodwill. And that one was a really popular Goodwill too. I just lucked out. Use the puck to knock the ball into the hole. To move the puck, click on Cheshire the Cheshire Undead, thank you for the six months. Um... What the? F oh, this is suddenly more difficult. Did I fuck it up? I think I fucked it up. Board game reviews. You know, I have started playing more. Uh, Use the puck to I have started to play a little more board games. I just got a game called on the spot where you uh, Sagrada go. that we've been playing. Really enjoy it. It's a, a dice drafting game. You roll dice and then draft game, draft dice to build a stained glass mirror. It's kind of like Sudoku. It's kind of like Sudoku. Uh, like competitive Sudoku. I, it's really fun. Uh, this is only the second puzzle. How am I already stuck on the second puzzle? How the fuck am I supposed to do this? What happens if I do this? What are the rules of this? Okay. Was that it then? This... Am I dumb? Oh, wait. Oh, you can move the puck to a specific piece. Okay, okay, I am dumb. I'm dumb. I thought your puck had to go all the way across. Sushi Go. I have not played Sushi Go yet. Arcade video would be good. Obscuro Vision. Thank you for the Prime sub. Arcade mm -hmm. video could be fun. What if I did an arcade video? I'd have to go to an arcade, which is now more difficult for me. I'm further away from... Uh, any arcade than I was. Su 
sushi. I'm trying to think if sushi. I've played sushi go. I've played some type of restaurant game. I don't know if it was sushi base. Still in the empty spot. Different version of Uno. I actually do have quite a few versions of Uno. I unintentionally started collecting them. Magus Juti, thank you for the 13 months. Your stream is a great way to start the weekend. Any nice arcades in the new neighborhood? Hopefully no more moves for a while. Yeah, that's that's one of the few things that uh, my new area doesn't really have. There's really no arcades uh, super close. Although... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna seriously consider that. I'm gonna seriously consider arcade as a, as an option. Cause I did come across like a really small, like a tiny mall arcade, and it's that would be very different. Uh, it would compared to my other arcade videos. It might be cool to do a a tinier a arcade. On the elevator to reach the checkered flags. Click on the card. Galaxy Bear Cat, started. thank you for the prime sub. Headlights on. Mysterium. I have not played Mysterium. I don't have Uno Extreme. Is, is Uno Extreme the one that shoots the cards at you? Because I did have that growing up and I, I absolutely loved it. No, that was Uno Attack. Uno Attack shot the cards at you. I've heard of Seven Wonders. I've yet to play it, though. Build a car that can use the elevators and get to the checkered flags. Perfection, I'm sorry. I hated, um... Perfection. I didn't like Perfection, and I didn't like... Uh, operation. It's funny that you mentioned per perfection because I just was talking about it the other day. I was trying to remember the name of it because I could I could visualize the commercial with the guy with the pieces popping out of his thing, and I remember him going "Wah!" Pop goes, and then I was like, "What? What was the name of the game though?" I it went pop. It was perfection. Put the pieces into the slot. Make the right selection. Figure out the pattern but be of the quick, you're the racing the clock. Wow! Pop goes perfection. By Milton Bradley! Jasmine, 879. Mm. Thank you for the 33 months. 33 months, that's a lot of months. It sure is. Did I play Mousetrap? I did, I don't have it currently. I did just buy Candyland. I bought the original, uh, well not the, I don't know if it was the original, but the version that I played, I think it was the late 80s version of Candyland. You really gotta build and make some house rules. Candyland is, is so simple that it's like, you either need to be inebriated or you need a lot of house rules, or maybe both, <laughs> to make it uh, entertaining. Who's my favorite Candyland? It's gotta be Lord Licorice. Lord Licorice is definitely the best Candyland character. Haven't heard of Grape Escape. I asked my sister, I was like, what board games did we play as a kid? And she sent me Hi-Ho Cheerio. And my immediate thought was, do they make that game anymore? Because the, the little pieces are so tiny and they're literally, they're cherries. It almost encourages you to, to take a bite. <laughs> Lord Licorice is a dill. <laughs> Haven't played Sheriff of Nottingham. 
Oh, whoops. I feel like I can't get Shoots and Ladders because I got Candyland. Candyland and Shoots and Ladders are too... They just play themselves, you know? Build a car that follows the rule on the elevator to reach the checkered flags. Click on the car to make it start. I play a lot of... Uh, we like to play Game of Life. Game of Life is a great one. I don't know some of your Candyland house rules. We're, we just started experimenting with the Candyland house rules, but currently, since since it's one-on-one, uh, -on -one, what we like to do is you, you control two characters instead of just one. And so, like, if you draw a double color, you're able to move both pieces or move just one piece... And then you could strategically hold somebody back to try and get a, uh, to, to try and farm for like a, a character card to move up. And then also we have uh, like sorry rules. So if you land on the same space as somebody oh, else, they have to wow. go back to, to beginning. You just gotta, you just gotta, you know, just keep adding rules until it's like, this is too much. <laughs> Better than Moo, thank you for the eight months. No, no, thank you. I don't remember them making a game of life too. Mm, what a hamburger. Figure out the pattern of the objects on the conveyor belt. Then fill in the empty spots. Oh, this I'm enjoying this a lot more than Reader Rabbit. Pokemon board games. I didn't play that one. I know that because I asked on Twitter for just like board game recommendations, casual board game recommendations, and a number of people said the po they they said they loved the Pokemon board game, but that it was really difficult or something like that. For some reason, they liked it but didn't like it. Computer Beach Party, thank you for the three months. Finally caught a live stream again. Congrats on the new place, Ian. Thank you very much. Especially since you bought merchandise. Especially since you bought merchandise. I think I should be able to win, but I'm gonna keep collecting pieces. Use the white pieces to build and line up the top, front, and side. Ikiru beat! Ikiru beat! Thank you for the five dollars and change. Have you ever heard or or have you ever played or heard of the playroom? I had it for Mac, but they remastered it for Windows. It has those reading rabbit creep vibes, but I loved it as a kid. Love your stuff. Um, your content makes me feel like things will be okay. The Playroom. I'm going to search real quick. Sounds familiar. Playroom uh, computer game. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. This is, um, it's by the same people that did um, Bailey's Book House, it looks like. Yes, this is extremely familiar to me. I don't think I, I have it currently. Bailey's book house. Did I did I do a video on Bailey's book house or did I just mention it um, once or twice? You never recovered from Bailey's book house. Do I have any retro consoles? I sure do. In fact, I don't even have. Well, that's not true. I have a Switch. I guess the Switch. The Switch is the only current console that I own. I think. I did a full vid. I was trapped in the game. I don't remember that at all. Oh, I remember Sammy Science House. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the board. I'm gonna make it back to the board now. I think I've got enough pieces. Spaceship game, different activities. Main one in my mind is a marble conveyor belt. Rube Goldberg. Well, when I think Spaceship Two Kids, I think of, um, oh my God. Oh my God, it, it wasn't Math Blaster. Did Math Blaster eventually get characters?
I didn't like the new Wii Sports. It's not that uh, I really hated the Wii Sports. It just doesn't feel finished or full, and I don't... I don't really get why they... Oh, shit! Motherfucker. Just feels light on the game. I do like the online bowling. Uh, but that's kind of about it. It's not that it's bad. It's just not not really better than the original. Um, okay, I'm going to go over, up three, through a forest. If I have a... Hamburger. Are you kidding me? I can't do that. Okay, I'm going to have to go one, two, three. Yeah, I'm going to have to do this. I'm looking forward to golf, though. Yeah, see, I don't like that you have to play online to unlock stuff. I don't like how slow it is to unlock stuff. I don't like the, the timed sets of stuff, then you gotta wait for new ones. I wish there was just a store of shit that I could buy. It's just a little, some confusing decisions, I feel like. Oh, I should just do... I should just do this. Sunder CR, thanks for the four months. How's it going, man? Good to see you. And over there for thank you for the two months. Bam. Incentive to, see, incentive to get you to play I'm online play, but pay. like why? Why? <laughs> Why basically force me to play online to get stuff if I don't if I don't want to do that? Board puzzle pieces you earned. Each time you beat Morty at his strategy game, I'll give you more pieces. Click on the billboard to see the puzzle pieces Rusty gave you. Fine. Put the pieces together in the center of the billboard. Once you earn all the pieces, you will be able to finish the picture. But it's not, you know, it's not T just because I I'm not super thrilled with it doesn't mean I'm not going to play it, <laughs> you know? I just ex expected a little more. And honestly, you know, to go to the warehouse, I'm kind of bummed that they built we out this big want. world turn here and it looks really cool and you can't get in there at all. It's it feels like a waste to not let me at least walk between events or something like that. Um, not that that was anything that we sports did, but it just feels like a missed opportunity. Oh, hey, Kata Wolf. This is Mission Think. And I'm over here using my brain and thinking. Build a car that follows the rule on the elevator to reach the checkered flags. Click on the car to make it start. See, I never played. Everyone's, uh... I've been, uh told of Wii Sports Resort, but I never played Wii Sports Resort, so maybe I should check that out. That's a Wii U one, right? Mission stink. Oh, it was on regular Wii? I had no idea. Oh, bullshit. I really liked Go Vacation. I really would love a Go Vacation too. I I don't think it's gonna happen. Would love it though. Everybody's golf servers are shutting down in September and there's no replacement slated for it yet. That sucks. I think Go Vacation was on Wii as well, but they did a Switch port. Um and if you like those kind of casual, it's like a mini game collection with a huge overworld. Really fun, really fun to do co-op as well. Build a car that can use the elevators and get to the checkered flags. Ever play any other games in this series? The only other one that I can think of, because the Super Solvers, I think the only other one I played was Treasure Mountain. Um, I 
think that was a Super Solvers game. Oh, I forgot that you could choose music. I totally missed that. Hell yeah. I look like I'm in a sepia filter. I don't have my lighting down yet. I'm being lit by the outside light, which I really hate doing. I also don't have any of my fun uh, color lights up yet, so. Oh shit. Figure out the pattern on the conveyor belt. Then, fill in the empty spots with the objects on. Most of the Clue Finders games have aged. This is fun. Like I'm, I'm legitimately enjoying this. I would force my child to play, to play this were I to have one. And thanks for the bits, Chicken Man cometh. Oh, fucking! These guys suck. Wordsum. Thank you for the prime sub. Virtual. I have virtual villagers. Um, I've never played it. Figure out the pattern of the objects on the conveyor belt. Then fill in the empty spots. But that is a game that I have. I've heard people mention it occasionally. Is that what a? Is that one a simulator thing? Kind of like a, the Sims. Maybe I could try that in between waiting for the the Sims collection to come in. God mode thing. Hmm. Oh, did I? Oh, is it not just red, blue, red, blue? That's how I would parent. I would parent with, with retro educational software. And I would demand excellence. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Build a car that will use the correct elevator and get... The Temple Guards. Oh my god, it does have kind of a uh, Legends of the Hidden Temple uh, vibe. You know, that was a show I always wanted to do a video on. I, I never really figured out how I would do it. But I think it'd be fun to cover the old Legends of the Hidden Temple a little bit. Figure out the pattern on the conveyor belt. Then, fill in the empty spots with the objects on the shelves. So just blue, red, green, blue, red, green. Is that green? No way. Mm, what a hamburger. Is that green? I guess that's green. Ari Lou, thank you for the four months. Retrospective videos are great since the critique doesn't have to exist. I like to critique. the white pieces oh, to build and fucking. line up the top, front, and side.
Bing. One of these days, we're, we'll do a... Uh, we should do a Tonka day, because I've got all these Tonka games. And I only really remember one, but I know people fondly recall the others. Tonka is like a uh, construction equipment. You dump trucks and... Well, not dump trucks. <laughs> dump trucks is not construction equipment. Didn't they have a... Like a fancy controller thing for the Tonka games? Oh, wow. oh I loved Incredible Machine. Oh, I loved Incredible Machine. Incredible Machine 3.0, I think, was the one that I played endlessly. Oh, I would, I would definitely play that on here, actually. Figure out the pattern on the conveyor belt. Did not play Cake Mania. Can't say I remember that one. I know what ducks want. Thank you for the seven months. I like wet bread, and I cannot lie. Finally, we get to know what the ducks want. Finally. And it's wet bread. Please play Clue Finders. I think I have... Didn't we play Clue Finders really briefly? Didn't I put a Clue Finders game on at some point? Super Crunchers? I played Number Munchers and Word Munchers. I don't know if that's related. It sounds related. Build a car that will use the correct elevator and get to the checkered flags. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, Munchers, not Crunchers. Yeah, I thought maybe Super Crunchers was a mix. Super Munchers must have been the one that combined both number and word, right? Stab happy nips. <laughs> Thank you for the two months. Super Munchers was about trivia. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Oh, well, he just left it there. Oh, fuck, here he comes, here he comes. This, here he comes! Oh. See, I'm not good at history and biology, you know, that kind of a thing. That's, that's for smart people. I'm good at puzzles and, uh, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Thank you for the bits, Tech Worm. I'm getting that box up here. Oh shit. Doubt. Can I not jump that? I guess I can't jump that. Use the puck to knock the ball into the hole. This game would have stressed you out as a kid. I, I don't know. I loved this uh, logic puzzle stuff. I mean, even now, it's like just I, I will I'll lose myself to this, even though it's a kid's game. I'll just sit here all day. I want to make it back to the 
use the puck to knock the ball into the hole. To move the puck, click on the spot where you want it. I want to get back to the main puzzle here in a second. I won't be fin finishing this, by the way. I'm just, I'm just having fun. Thor Obliterator, thank you very much for the 31 months. Okay. Close one. Okay. Yeah, I think I should just... I'd like to do a new, another uh, frozen food review, but it can't be my next food video. I need to do something. I need to, like, cook something first. I think that needs to be one of my next ones. Some guilty pleasure games. I don't know that I have guilty pleasure games. Have I ever considered trying to do show foods? Oh, like based on a a menu, like a on a well, on a show. <laughs> um, I don't know what I would do. I don't know what show. Do they eat any food in Yu-Gi-Oh that I could recreate? I'm not. I'm not positive that they do. If no square lights up. I'm working on it. Isn't the coin game a guilty pleasure? No, I'm not. I don't feel guilty about that at all. Coin game is just a dope game. Suck it. Maybe you they don't eat a lot in Yu-Gi-Oh. It distracts from them playing <laughs> card games. They eat. They eat fish with Mako Tsunami. Good job. They eat. Well, take a look at the new billboard puzzle pieces you earned. Well, what am I guilty about? Not I don't. Not much. <laughs> One Piece cookbooks. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I, I don't. I don't know anything about One Piece except that uh, I think his his arms are really stretchy. Click on the tube to go to the... Click on the tube. Mokuba has a Russian roulette food game in the pre-game manga chapters. I need to finish that. I have... I have at least some of the Yu-Gi-Oh! manga, like the opening before it goes uh, to Duel Monsters pretty exclusively. To knock the ball into the hole. Gotta watch season zero. I wish they would dub season zero. I've seen some of it. I just, I, I really, it's really hard for me to pay attention to subtitles because I, I feel like no matter what I'm doing, I'm always doing two things. I, I can't sit and read subtitles because I, I gotta be doing something else. To move the puck, click on the spot where you want it to go. Uh, this game's this game is called Mission Think. Uh, Bionic. Build a car that will use the correct elevator and get to the checkered flags. No. Ooh, that's what I like. Am I the Oregon Trail guy? Oh no, I click on the car to try again. I failed. I 
Man, now I got, I'm thinking about the incredible machine, honestly. Use the white pieces to uh, build and line up the top, front, and side views of the 3D. I'm gonna seriously, I'm, I'm also thinking about the, uh, do an arcade video at a really tiny mall arcade. I'm actually thinking that might be kind of fun. Because like round one, Dave and Buster's, like the chain arcades tend to look the same, but a teeny local one would, uh, you know, be a bit different. Build a car. Is this my least favorite type of puzzle? Honestly, these puzzles I'm, you know, neither here nor there about. I really like the board. If I could take out this part and just do the board game parts, I think I'd like that better. Um, but it also is, I mean, it's kind of cool that um, you have to earn the pieces. I mean, that's, that's something. Video on rhythm games in arcade. The problem with doing a video on a rhythm game is would be music copyright. Because you want to show off the music, but all the music is going to get flagged by uh, YouTube. So that one's a tough one. Just insert jazz music. Just... Find the tempo of the song, replace it with an equally Use fast the to knock the ball jazz the song. There are some interesting ones. Like round one, they have a lot of interesting, uh, weird looking rhythm games. What's Groove Coaster? I've never heard of Groove Coaster, but that's, is it roller coaster themed rhythm game? Because that sounds great. I have no idea what Zack and Wiki is. Figure out the pattern of the objects on the conveyor belt. Then, Fill in the empty spots with the objects on the shelves. I really only have rhythm experience with, um, you know, like the, the classics. DDR, Guitar Hero, Rock Band, which are kind of the same thing. Donkey Konga, you know. Sputlo, thank you for the prime sub. You want to get that, like, the Mario DDR? Okay, it's a game where you go along a roller coaster and hit notes along it, and the most fun part is that there's secret notes that are hidden. I'm gonna have to look that up. That sounds on brand for me. I, I played a little bit of the Mario DDR, but it was too easy. Oh, Rhythm Heaven is, is awesome, yes. The elevators and get to the checkered flag. Rhythm Heaven may be one of my favorites um, as well. I also have the Game Boy Advance Rhythm Heaven, but I, I don't think I've beat that one. But man, I played the DS one like crazy. I tried the Wii one, but I didn't I didn't really like using the Wii mote 
Use the white pieces um, to build and line up to do top. rhythm stuff. I really and preferred the the tapping on the DS yet. was really really Click satisfying. Tap and flick or whatever. I actually think that this was my favorite of the puzzles when I was a kid. I think this one was the one I was always excited to do. It's just like elevator action. Dude, it does look like elevator action. I remember um, one of my best friends growing up, he had a, uh, like the MAME arcade joystick controllers. They're like professional arcade controllers for your uh, PC. And man, we would just go over and just play a bunch of random arcade. And elevator action was one of the ones that we'd play all the time. Yeah, the XRK, that's what it's called. That's what it was. I was so jealous. Oh my God. My jealousy raged. Let's see here. I'm going to have to go. I need a... Well, yeah, I need a... I need a canoe and I need more movement pieces. This is Mission Think. It looks it looks like a bad sequel to Gizmos and How what how is this different from Gizmos and Gadgets? Cuz I never played that one. Um but it does come up when I mention or play this one. Like I don't know what the The difference between the two are... I gotta sneeze. Figure out <laughs> the in the conveyor belt. Gizmos and Gadgets then, has a different mini-game you get parts for. Jinji is more mechanical engineering. Interesting. I probably would have liked it. I mean, if it was a, if it was a logic puzzle game, I'd probably probably be all over it. What about the? Uh, there's a game on here that people want me to play. This one. Anyone have memories of uh, connections? It's a mind game. This is one that comes up sometimes that I've never played. It's got, it looks like it's got FMB. There's like a castle. And there's like, there's like a guy. <laughs> there's like a guy down here. Enter a world of spectacular, lushly detailed 3D environments that render you unable to leave. Looks very weird. I do remember when PC games had big boxes. I miss I miss having stuff to put on the shelf. My camera's Use yeah. Right this camera doesn't like uh, it doesn't like checkerboard pattern. When it's scaled down, it doesn't like lines or checkerboard patterns. It looks super weird. To see a view. No ghosts in the house so far. New house has been great. It's just a lot to do. There's there's always a lot to do. Um, but I'm happy to be streaming a little bit more. Makes me feel like I'm a bit more on the ball. I'm gonna do more like this is just kind of a low pressure stream here. I didn't even really know what I was doing. I just kind of turned it on and here we are. 
Yes, I am going to put up lighting. I just don't know. I haven't figured out the rest of my office yet. I don't know. Because I feel like I need some more shelves. I actually did buy a shelf for over here. So maybe I could stream the assembly of that one. Um, but I feel like I need another shelf. Yeah, I need purple lights. I need to make the whole room blue. Are you kidding me? It. I really want to get on that second level there. It's not going to let me. I know that's not what I'm supposed to do, but that's what I want to do. Use the white pieces to build and line up the top. Have I played Richard's Scary Busy Town? Why does that sound familiar? Did one of you guys send me Busy Town? That sounds really familiar. Oh, I have it right here. It looks interesting. 13 original stereo songs with sing-along lyrics. Special movie mode. No, we're not, we're not playing that today. This is, this is, this is, uh... Nice simple stream. I'm not I'm not trying to to play too many different things today. Laurelin 95. Thank you for the 2 months. Thank you for 2 months of quality streams alongside many years of top tier content, Ian. Long may it continue. Give that back. Use the puck to knock the ball into the hole. What do you how long do you think a virtual villagers would engage for a stream do you think that would be a full you know three or four hours um playing that or is that kind of a one and done long game I didn't do a review on Busy Town. I did a review of Money Town, which I also still have. Oh, there we go. There we go. Not what I wanted to do. Probably something that's more chill heavy. You're waiting around for things a lot. Yeah, see, I um, I haven't played any like God mode kind of a game. I, I don't think that I've ever played a game like that. Okay, if I start here, go up through over canoe yeah okay let's give it a shot is <laughs> this hotel mario 
Yeah, black and white, I think, is the only one that I... I would even be able to name. Oh, that's not where I thought it was going to put me. I thought I was going to be able to go... Oh, I guess I can't go diagonal through it. Well, that's... Yeah. Is Civilization, a, is that considered a god game? I, I thought that was more like a strategy. Um, like a strategy game. You're not like managing people. AoE 2 kind of feels maybe a little more god mode, you know, you're controlling individual people at least. Civ is a 4X. I see I don't even know. I don't even know what that means. I don't think this is gonna work. Oh, dude, he went all the way down here with his canoe. Yeah, it's crazy that AoE 2 still lives on. It was, it was my first... Uh... Is it RTS? It was my first like strategy game that I actually got into, and it was just because, um, it was just because. Oh shit! I can't do that. He'll block me if I go there, huh? It's really my only option, though. He's probably gonna block me. It was just because we did land parties. Like, um, if it hadn't been for for playing together in the same room, I would have never been able to get into that game. But uh, man, did I love it! Thank you for the challenge, Mr. Maxwell. Hey, this is supposed to be my game. Great job! You earned some more billboard puzzle pieces. Sure did. Here we two on the MSN zone. I can't say I ever played on the MSN zone. I can't say that that's something that I uh, was even aware of. All right. I'm actually going to wrap it. I just want to do a quick little, um, you know, just kind of fun hangout, test the, is this saved? Your game will be saved. Fun, fun. I want to, uh, <laughs> time to load you up. It sure isn't. It sure isn't. I'm going to try and uh, hop in for these shorter streams occasionally in between longer ones. But uh, I had a lot of fun. I'm happy that all of this, all of my old computer stuff seems to be um, functioning. And I'm going to think about what you guys said video-wise. I'm going to really uh, consider what my my next video adventure shall be. Yeah, it's you guys. Can you see you guys back there? All right. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching. I will be back soon with something. Uh, next time my stream will play something uh, completely different. So have a great uh, day or whatever. That's not the most attractive one ever, but you know. 
have a great day. Have a great day, and uh, I will I will talk to you guys soon. Okay, bye.